Let's take a closer look at the review workflow in Adobe Captivate Draft. When you're ready to review a project with your team in Draft, click on the project and hold. You'll see a series of icons appear above the project. There you'll see a mail icon. Click on the mail icon in order to initiate a review process with your colleagues. Choose a date by which you'd like the review to be complete. Enter the email address of any colleague you'd like to include in the review. Notice the new icon. That icon indicates that this is now a review version of Draft. Now simply tapping on the screen will cause a new review bubble to appear. You can add comments by typing them directly into the comment section. You also can add comments by using the draw feature. Click on the squiggle and then draw directly onto the screen. When you're ready to send comments to a colleague, click the little airplane. Once you've added comments to the project, you're free to go ahead and exit the project. Once the author is satisfied that all of the comments are in, the author can add additional people to review. The content author can then see the comments from various people making comments on the project. They also have the ability to add additional reviewers to the comments. The author can also close the project for review. A prompt will appear asking if you're sure you want to retire the review section. At that point, the project will appear with a no symbol. Click on the project to open it. You'll note that comments are still viewable inside the project. Click the comments icon in order to continue examining the comments. Click the map icon in order to see the project in detail. When you click done, you will be able to delete all comments from the document and return it to normal editing mode. Once returned to normal editing mode, your project can continue to be developed. That's the comment workflow in Adobe Captivate Draft.